Happy Monday, everyone. Hello, hello, hello. I'm your host, Andy Asher, and welcome to the Let's Talk Variety Show. So a week ago, we featured a segment on the show about the new Netflix action hero series starring 75-year-old action hero Arnold Schwarzenegger. And what grabbed me about it then is how utterly amazing and inspiring that we can accept and believe older people achieving some amazing exploits, even being fictional. The reality of it is, though, over the years since we started doing all these programs on this show, we have featured people achieving some amazing exploits after age 55, and we frequently have them as guests on our shows. Arnold's new action series on Netflix is called FUBAR. I will save you the time to look it up and what it means. FUBAR is a military slang and a word. Now, I can't repeat it all here, but it's effed up beyond all recognition. It is said to be a, a term that comes from World War II and refers to any situation or person that has gone wrong and there is no possibility of repair. At 75, it is classic Arnold Schwarzenegger. Arnold has two Netflix specials right now and the, the other one is called Arnold, the documentary about the man behind the muscles, uh, where he says, if you're always hungry, you're never really satisfied. After all, the man has reinvented himself countless times as a professional bodybuilder, an actor, a filmmaker, a businessman, a politician, and an inspiring resume for a kid from a small town in Austria. Arnold. And when you visualize something very clearly, you believe that you 100% can get there. There was a lot of things they had to learn. Obstacles that they had to overcome. There is a lot more to talk about, Arnold, and we will do that all this week. In fact, in Mimi's kitchen, she's been making delicious smoothies since the start of the summer. And in honor of Arnold and his achievements, she has concocted Arnold, Arnold smoothies and shakes that taste great, build muscle naturally without protein powders. I don't use protein powder, so I really use, try to use all the proteins I can have. Thank you, Mimi. We'll get right back for today's Arnold shake. If you are watching the Let's Talk Variety show for the first time, it takes its name and its roots from a legendary period of network television when shows would entertain, would inform, and inspire. Today, there are so many similarities and differences right now, primarily because this show is live streamed on several platforms every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And you can watch it on YouTube and Facebook, and there are other platforms that stream as well. And at the end of today's show, I will give you three ways that you can help keep the Let's Talk Variety Show growing and getting bigger guests. Now let's go to our newsstand uh, segment. And uh, what else do you do, do you think you do when you uh, go to the Safeway checkout stand line, you look for the National Examiner, and how's that for a grabbing headline? Arnold, 75, my one and only regret. It's the most painful chapter from Arnold Schwarzenegger's new memoir, Total Recall. The moment when he admitted to Shriver that he had fathered a child behind her back with the family's housekeeper, Mildred Baena. She then said, hey, I think that um, uh, Joseph is your kid. And uh, am I off here on this or, or not? And I said, you're absolutely correct. More on uh, what the National Examiner had to say and what they wrote about next time. And now let's get back into the Mimi's Kitchen where she is making the Arnold Protein Shake without protein powder. Mimi? Hello, hello. Here again for a wonderful protein shake. And I don't use protein powder, so I really use try to use all the proteins I can have, like uh, mil uh, almond milk, almond butter, and 
fresh raw almonds with some fruits and spinach so it's gonna be delicious if you like to work out and you know you, you know you put like a Schwarzenegger <laughs> he goes to the gym I bet you that's what he drinks you know to maintain his uh... all right let's do it so we need a cup of blueberry you can use frozen blueberries I use fresh okay a cup of baby spinach and everything is organic as usual all right nope we're not gonna lose any of that a half of a frozen banana you can use it you know fresh one tablespoon of almond butter right like that and a cup of organic almond milk. Voila! Well, we're gonna start doing this. Woo! You know the almonds are really, really, really good. There you go. We're gonna use our nice bullet. Alright. Perfect. So, this is nice. See, I didn't need a powder to make it thick because the almond butter makes it thick and the banana makes it creamy. And you have all those beautiful, 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 beautiful vegetables and fruits. And to make it a little bit crunchy, if you like that, if you want to eat it with a spoon, you can put some raw um, you know to almond on top like just crushed like that see can you see now i'm gonna taste it mm. it is very good so this is for muscle breathing to help you it's all protein all right see you next time thank you mimi it, it looks absolutely delicious and I want to thank you for supporting the show. If you like it or you learn something new, I want to tell you the three ways that you can support the show and keep the Let's Talk Variety Show going on, okay? Number one, get yourself subscribed. Every show, I am bringing inspirational guests who can uh, teach or have something interesting to talk about. So just take a moment to hit that subscribe button that's all you have to do and number two this is really the ultimate way to support the let's talk variety show and it takes just less than a minute to do so you can write a write something you know short and sweet like you know i love this show it, it has changed your life or something that you learn from it i am really not exaggerating that i read reviews every single day and every single one whether it is short or long it really does mean everything to me uh, and the more reviews means the higher we rank on all those algorithms, which means bigger guests. So just take a minute to leave a review. And then three, you know, share the show with your friends. Just hit that share button. We live stream Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And I am eternally grateful. Thank you so much for supporting the Let's Talk Variety Show. It's about productivity, positivity, and happiness.